Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Nathan from My Crypto Paradise. In this video we will look at one of the top coins which is the Bitcoin Cash. Yes, the brother of the Bitcoin which for some reason doesn't follow the Bitcoin that much. But we will look at the price action against the USDT from various perspective. Basically we will go through a little bit different format today analyzing multiple time frames for the Bitcoin against the dollar which should be quite entertaining. At the same time, we will look through the general market sentiment and the coin market cap. Let's jump to the coin market cap and we can see that Bitcoin Cash is currently ranked number 11 and the total market cap is $9,979,000,000, which is big. But the most interesting thing here is look at the graph. Seven day chart shows that the price is actually struggling to make any sort of move. In fact, it has been declining. And look at other coins. Well, most of them are in green, but Bitcoin Cash is really, really struggling. The big question is what is happening, whether the price will continue to rise or continue to fall. And in this video, we will try to understand that. Moving on to the coin 360, the general market sentiment is bullish. We can see that most of the coins are in green, Bitcoin up 5%, Ethereum 2%, ADA 15%, ADA actually going quite good. The last time we made a video, it was up 20%. This time it's 15%. So clearly a big, big improvement in the price. Time to move to the price action. Starting with a Bitcoin cash against the dollar on the weekly time frame. Well, the big picture is clearly bullish because we did break above the previously made high at $500, which does validate the ongoing uptrend. Now here we have several trend lines. First is the big trend uptrend trend line. And as we can see, there were multiple rejections of this trend line. Also, we can see that the price has bounced off the 50 simple moving average. There were few spikes, although it got rejected along with the long term uptrend. On the other hand, we have the resistance uptrend trend line and we have a minor uptrend trend line. And based on this pattern, we have an ascending wedge, which means that the price could be retesting the resistance trend line. If that will be the case, price is likely to test $900 psychological resistance. Now, this resistance is based on 927.2% Fibonacci retracement level, and this FIBS was applied to the first pullback after price actually bottomed out. We spoke about this technique previously. You can watch one of the videos how it is possible to find where the market will top out. In the next charts, we will show you why this level is actually so important and why we might be expecting the price to produce a big green candle. This could be as soon as the next week, a big green candle, which corresponds to the resistance trend line. We can see that this trend line, the wedge got rejected. So there was this bounce weekly close failed to be below. And right now we also trading right at this trend line, which should be or likely to push the price higher towards the new high at 900 resistance area. Let's move to the two day chart. And here we have applied an average price uptrend trend line. We had this bounce again, bounce again, bounce. So we had these multiple bounces, which makes it an average price trend line. The most interesting part is that there was break above the trend line, suggesting that the trend has changed from bearish to bullish. Then there was another breakout and price has produced this low after we had the break and close above the trend line. Now this support at $509 certainly is holding because there was no closing price below this level. In fact, price has spiked down, tested the 50 simple moving average, bounced off, at the same time bounced off this support at $509 and as we can see, 
it is actually trading near this support once again so five hundred dollars psychological support is very very important level for the bitcoin cash prior to that the price action as we can see there was the resistance major resistance at 372 dollars now this resistance became obviously the support where we saw the bounce back in January 2021. All this price action is strongly in favor of an uptrend continuation, which might result in a price growth towards the 900 resistance, which is the 65% move. And as you can see, we have two FIPS here, 927 and 627. Now, the second FIPS was applied to this pullback where we got rejected the moving average. And clearly, there are two FIPS confirming that 900 level is a strong resistance. Moving on to the 16 hour chart. And on this chart, price is moving within the ascending channel after it produced an A, B and C corrective pattern based on the Elliott wave theory. So this is the corrective part and meaning that the major trend remains bullish and based on the channel we had the bounce of the bottom of the channel very clean bounce and prior to that there was the bounce of the 200 moving average. So price remains above the moving average price remains within the ascending channel. What is also very very important is that we have several Fibonacci support levels where all of them got rejected one by one. So this FIBS was applied to this corrective move where we can see there was 23.6% acted as the support. Then we had 38.2% acted as the support. And right now we're having 500 level acting as the support yet again. And this is truly a very, very bullish pattern for the Bitcoin cash against the dollar, which might be sending the price up towards the 900 resistance. Moving on to the four hour chart. Now on this chart, we are forming a triangle pattern. The most important part here is that price broke above the downtrend trend line. At the same time, it rejected the uptrend trend line. Another point is the bounce of the 200 exponential moving average and formation of this low or the support at $500 exactly psychological level. So we had this bounce of the moving average and then we retested this support at $500 which makes it a key level to watch. Now also another extremely important thing there was the bounce of the moving average there was a very clean rejection of the moving average which doesn't allow price to go up at this point in time therefore it is extremely extremely important that we break above 545 dollars for the bulls to step in Prior to that, there could be consolidation ongoing between $500 and $545. So there is this possibility of a continuous range trading. And if we break below the support, then there could be a further price decline. So very important that the price will break above the $545. And also on this chart, we have another FIBS applied to the pullback after we had the break above the trend line, which shows us that 361.8 FIBS almost exactly corresponds to our previous resistance mentioned at $890. So there are third Fibonacci level suggesting that this is a very, very strong resistance that must be watched. It could be a supply area if the price breaks above and reaches this resistance, which is highly likely considering that the cryptocurrency market is still very bullish. And before we move to the final chart, which is a one hour chart, I would like to show you some of our trades that we just had in the past few days. So one of them was Tron TRX against the dollar. So there was our entry at 0.05 and you can see what happened. The first 
target has been reached within just five days 18 hours there was some consolidation although we can see that price is getting very very bullish and guys we also made analysis on the tron in our previous videos we analyzed it yet again in the last video so go and check that out if you are interested in the price action of the tron and what can be expected further and just one of the most recent trades which is sxp usdt is buying signal at 3.03 dollars and here is the result nearly zero drawdown price has reached target one which did take only 24 hours this was pretty fast move literally zero drawdown and we still expect a huge move to the upside with the final target being at 4.45 and these are just few of many, many profitable trades that we share with the Paradise VIP family members. Let's move to the Bitcoin Cash final one hour chart. And on this chart, price also moving within the ascending channel. This is not the same channel that we have used previously, so different channel. And here we had the bounce of the bottom of the channel. Price has formed this low at $508. And it also bounced off the 200 and simple moving average. So there was no break below, no close below. There was only a spike lower, which tested $509 support. And this makes the area between 500 and 510 an extremely, extremely important support zone. And as long as it holds, this will be a bullish trend on the other hand what we have is the bounce of the 200 moving average so there clearly is the resistance which we talked about already at 545 dollars and we need to break above for the trend to continue moving up unless that happens expect the range trading but the probability strongly favors that this breakout will occur pushing the price towards the $900 resistance. Maybe price will attempt to retest the trend line before moving up. Maybe there will be even break below retesting the support area and then moving up. But watching these both support areas first is near 520 then 500 will be very very interesting especially for the long-term buyers and investors. All right, that was all for today, ladies and gentlemen. Don't forget to take it easy and smooth and see you next time.